Hi, another video walkthrough from your good friends at Addicting Games. Uh, my name's Sid and I'm here with Mike. Say hi, Mike. Hello. Uh, today we're going to be doing a video walkthrough for Click Try. Uh, Mike, what the, what's going on here? Well, here you have the intro of the game. This is the tribe hanging out and doing their thing. Suddenly they all decide to go attack this monster. And good. so there, there they are walking towards the monster, going through the village. It's a nice place to Sure. Colorful, windy, apparently. And there he is, the monster, and he's asleep, and uh, he gets really upset. Decides to throw him around a little bit. And this is where the tribe gets separated from each other. That's oh. Some of them end up in trees. Some of them, you know, in a well or something. Or oh, and now my house is on fire. All right. So, so there we are. Here's the game proper. Uh, we'll let you just watch carefully instead of trying to tell you how to do every little thing. Uh, this guy is your friend uh, with the... Uh, boy, I think those are antlers he has. But anyway, uh, he's useful because if you click the wrong thing, he'll shake his head. Uh, I see two of your friends there. It looks as if they're fighting and he's telling them to stop. Yes. Everyone just get along, okay? You gotta be one happy click tribe. Or we'll never defeat that monster who set the town on fire. I hope this is a story of revenge. Better not forgive and forget, or I'll be sorely disappointed. Yeah. Oh. Now, the first time I played this, I thought that little guy in the tree was hoping that they would drown him in it. But uh, it turns out he's actually uh, one of their friends. One of their smallest. And, uh, well, we'll see how important he is later. I'd like to say he's insignificant. He probably is a tribe. Every member of the tribe counts. It, ta it takes a tribe. It takes a tribe and a village to uh, uh, rescue a burning village from a robot monster. Words to live. All right, we're gonna commit an unspeakable crime in this scene. Um, one of your members, this blue guy on the right, you see he keeps holding up a fork and knife, which is uh, uh, click tribe language for, I would like to eat some raw bird. Um, so we'll accommodate. An excellent, an excellent example of teamwork. Yeah, birds love radishes. Ah, there we go. Gobble, 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 feathers and all. Now here's this, what is this? Venus flytrap of sorts? Some kind of living plant that has one of the tribesmen hostage? It's like an octopus plant or something? It's, um, yeah, it's freakish. I'm surprised they haven't just tried to kill it. Maybe you can't kill it. Maybe this is the, oh, this, this could be a dangerous planet that the Clay Tribe River lives on. You can kill birds, but you can't kill plants. If it's a plant, we don't even know. It's not blinking. Maybe it's just waving. You know? Oh, hello? Hello, I've got your friend captured here. I'm never gonna let him in. Hello, he makes a lovely earring. All right, so it looks like we're gonna build some sort of a uh, uh, click track pyramid to uh, get our friend down. It's just a matter of getting him in the right order. Cooperation. There's no I in T, although there are two I's in click track. There he is. Oh, an alligator. Maybe he's a crocodile. Sure, I think he's a crocodile. He's a crocodile. Crocodile, alladile, toothed reptile, big enough to eat you. Oh, I, I see the, the click tribe member who eats and carries a fork is also overweight. What kind of message is that? I'm surprised he didn't try to eat the crocodile. Will we be able to fool this animal with a radish? 
Now apparently this animal, whatever it is, this pig rhino spotted thing, only likes radishes when they're hanging from above. Ah! So he, he doesn't like tumors, he likes fruit. He likes, he likes the fruit. Or maybe it's a lichen. Alright. Fool, fool the pig rhino. Rhino. Yeah, yeah, fooled again. Look at you, just staring at that fool. What a fool. Rhinoso pig. Rhinoso, I like that. Rhinoso pig. From which we derive rhinoso pork chops. Oh, we carried them home. Very good. All right, village is still on fire. So uh, we should probably deal with it. So this is where you want to do a basic bucket brigade. No! Conveniently, Sweet. there's a well located right outside the village. Once again, we have to get, stand in the right order. It's important. Stretch there, yellow's got the bucket. Now don't step out of line. Yeah, Fatty got out of line there. I don't know. Hey! Come on! Yay! Oh, that's a happy day. Put the bucket back. Very good. Time there, to, there's time to wreak our vengeance on the monster. Now, I, I have to admit, Mike, I struggled in this battle. I, uh, oh, really? Yeah, I, I, had a, I had a heck of a time. Um, the monster was a uh, worthy opponent. He, well, he certainly was smarter than me. I got this part, you know, I can run between his legs, but, uh, you know, and take, take a few swipes at him, but, uh, boy, I just felt like I was just, you know, oh, there we go. Once you have a little tiny person on your back, you're pretty much done for it. But, uh, you know, I'm afraid, I'm afraid that players may know a faster way to defeat this robot. Can't say it's the best way to do it, but it's one way to do it. Just keep sending Fanny over there and poke him with the fork. I actually started snacking while I was doing this because I, I kept looking at that fork and that little fat guy and then I had... Well, first I ate a radish and uh, then I ate a raw bird and um, then I had a rhino pork chop. Would you like some pizza? I would like some pizza if it had uh, uh, radishes on it. I've got radish pizza right here. Would you like a piece? I would. Oh, thank you very much, there Mike. No, oh, ice cold, just the way I like it. Oh. Yeah, you, you can really taste the motor oil. It's a nice touch. Is that sand you put, you know, yeah, my favorite thing is, like, whenever I make baked potatoes in a little bit of foil, I don't take the foil off. I Sid, you're more man than I. It's, um, yeah, it's an acquired taste. I picked it up in the Navy. Um, sometimes we just had to gnaw on chips for sustenance. Now, do you suppose the robot monster is getting hungry with all this, uh, activity? All this arm waving he's doing? I like to think that he's, uh, uh, saying his last prayers as he prepares to die. Um, Maybe it's oh, there oh. we go! Yes! Ooh. Oh, the crossed eyes. My... Evans. That was a long battle. All right. Well, thank you very much for coming out. Uh, personal shout out to Mac and Lucky Eleven for uh, sending us those lovely blog posts. Uh, don't be afraid to write uh, because we probably won't catch up with you anytime soon. Thanks. Stay tuned. Bye.